Uh, hi guys, we're playing some Pokemon trading card game online and we're going to do something different. We're going to get a deck using a quiz that I've heard a lot of things about how shit this is. So what we're going to do is we're going to try creating one and then we're going to use it competitively in like the expert difficulty for modified and just see how far we get. So, deck wizard. To start your deck, pick two of your favorite Pokemon cards from below. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to pick two competitively viable cards. Let's go... What do I own that would be fun? Wow, this lag. This lag. That's better. Let's do it this way. Alright. What have we got that we could make a deck out of? Let's see what happens if we do... Hmm. It's so hard to pick. How many... Em I've got two Ember. Let's make a... Let's make a Reshibor deck. Alright. So we'll go back and we'll pick Reshiram, because I have eight of them and two Embor, and continue. Please wait while Deck Wizard configures your deck based around two Pokemon cards. All right, this sh that is actually really cool, except I don't. It doesn't run. Ce the Charizard would make sense if I ran Celebi, if it ran Celebi as well, because I'd be able to use Raging Claws, which is basically the same as Reshiram's Outrage does 10 more for each damage counter, but, oh, this actually kind of makes sense, except why, why would I need the coin flip? Who here does a coin flip? Do you do a coin flip? You do not do a coin flip. So, the deck has thrown in a flip teeny for the sake of it, and 20, 20, 20, and 20, 20 energy. Is it all fire? I'm clicking on energy. It's 20 fire energy. Oh wow, this is horror. What is this? This is going to be awesome. Alright, we're saving it. Whizbore. I don't know. I am original. Alright, now let's run our Whizbore deck. Burrito Smasher. You're going down, man. You're going down. My Whizboard deck is going to shit all over you. Oh, you're going down. Kids me the deck didn't even you mention an ace spec. It could have thrown in victory piece for Victini and then that would have been amazing. Oh, he just keeps mulliganing. This, we could actually have a chance. I think we're going to bring out Victini first. I think this is actually a viable deck, given not and everything. Yes. 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 Alright, not the best. Why does it have Dark Claw? They're all fire Pokemon. Jesus Christ. Alright. Kangaskhan, he's gone first, so he can't call for family. What a waste, good sir. What a waste. Oh. And Hypnobank's first turn. Yep. It's the only way to get a legitimate amount of damage in from from the get-go. And he's put me to sleep. And I wake up, so that's not too bad. So we do that. Let's just put a Dark Claw on him, just cause. And, uh... It's like two basic energy cards. Okay. And of course they're both going to go on Reshiram. Bam. I'm using the Deck Wizard to create this Terabad deck, don't mind me. All fire Pokemon. Wizard throws in Dark Claw. Guy probably isn't even reading this. A lot of people don't read the chat, unfortunately, but... <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, this is terrible. What's my retreat cost? One. That's not terrible. That's not absolutely horrible. We can throw that down. We'll throw down Victini. What's Victini's ability to move all energy stored on this Pokemon to one of your bench Pokemon? Alright, that's not the worst. We're going to retreat before Victini EX dies into Reshiram. Now, he's running Cobalion Keldeo, so he's obviously running Plasma Clank, but I'm not running many EXs apart from Victini. 
Oh, that would be amazing against his deck right now, though. Oh, victory piece, you've forsaken me. All right, so we're going to do blue flare, just so we can knock out his Genghis Khan straight away. Hopefully stop him from completely setting up. Yeah, Surpri not surprising that we haven't seen a single supporter so far. What's he doing? He's brought out his 60 HP clink. He's just buying time until he can come in and swing the Caldeo for win. So... Fire energy here. I have to. I have to start swinging. Or I'll lose him. I w if I could get a Charmander, this could this could go well. Constant choruses. Can you evolve yet? He can't evolve yet. Which one's this? I don't have any colorless Pokemon, and it gives me a special city gym. I will throw that down because that kills his Verbank. Um, we'll drop an energy on Victini. And we'll swing with Outrage. Done. He was going to bring out Keldeo EX because he's going to swing for 100 next turn. Because it does... Oh, Kangishkan. Interesting choice. Juniper! Yes! Finally got a supporter. That's awesome. Alright, so what's Burrito Smasher going to do? Apart from smash burritos. Yep, there's the energy as we full fully expected. The rush in and the swing does 100. Yeah, so I can hit for 120 next turn with outrage, or I can attach an energy to him and die. I think I'm gonna stick with this. Then I'm gonna juniper. See what we get if we get anything better. Oh, we got a Vic we got two Victini EXs. Let's drop another one just cause. And then let's swing with Outrage. It'll hit him for 100 total because he's got an Evo Light on, unfortunately. But that's still plenty. He's got 70 HP left. And that's that's enough for even my Victini EX here to knock him out. It'd be a prize trade, but... Oh, that's unless he gets... Is he finally going to get Kling Clang out? If he gets Kling Clang out, I could be screwed. Why would you do that, man? Why would you do that? Because now I'm just going to come in and swing with this guy. But then you come in with Keldeo, don't you? Yeah. This could be problematic. Hmm. Let's drop another Victini. Do I kill and then he takes two more prizes and I'm ahead in prizes? It's such a hard choice. I can... Accelerate a fresh Victini and then lose this Victini. Th sorry, Theory Crafting. If I use Turbo Energize, I can put two energy on a new Victini. I do that, he knocks out this guy. Then I switch Victini, knock him out. Doesn't matter who he brings out, it knocks out. Or. And. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Gonna do that. We're gonna drop a energy on Victini. That Victini. Um, Juniper. Yes. Let's see what we get. We got a Tepig. We got a Charmander. Should have put down Reshiram instead. Undo last action. Reshiram. Then we swing with Turbo Energize. Two Fire Energy. Okay. And one. So now he will swing for the kill on my Victini. He will take two prizes. I'll swing, take two prizes. His only choice will be to bring out one of his clank clinks or something. Oh. Oh. This is all ruined, of course, if he manages to evolve into Plasma Clang. If he evolves into Plasma Clang, I could be screwed. 
I need to turbo energize and put it on Reshiram instead. Whew. Is he going to do it? He did draw 10 cards. No, he still didn't get his Plasma Clang. He must, must be like a one of or something he's running. Alright. So, now let's shop Charmander. And let's Sharon for three. Easy. We can drop an energy on... We're going to drop on Reshiram because we, we should still be worried. And now I'll take my two prizes. Holy shit, if we win with this against a Plasma Clay, this horribly put together wizard deck doesn't even have a decent number of supporters. That's amazing. Okay. Yep, there it is. This changes everything. Okay. So all his metal Pokemon are safe from me. I still... He scoops. He scooped. Beautiful. Let's take a look at these. Time taken. I took four minutes. He took three minutes. Damage dealt. I dealt way more damage. Biggest attack was 200. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. What's my rewards? I got... 12 tokens. 13 tokens, I guess. Is that what that one means? Excellent. Alright, well, thank you very much for watching. That was the first of my deck wizard videos. It went way better than I expected. I It was terribly put together, but still worked. I, I got lucky. I'll see you on the next episode.